So overall look, um, what so you want I want to it to look natural, mm -hmm. but the last time I had it done um, with highlights, she didn't put many in. Okay. And I feel that it's over time it's got really dark mm -hmm. now. You probably see at the back it looks, it looks really dark. Yes, you, you are, you've got a lot of dark and you're holding a lot of dark natural in there. You're losing a bit of tone where you're going lighter naturally I say natural highlights mm. you're, you're grey around the front that's the grey around the front <laughs> yeah um but you know very you've not got a high percentage of mm. grey around here um but over time you do naturally lose the richness and the tone in your natural hair I think that's so, exactly yeah that's what yeah. makes it look so I don't want to say old but you know you you when you get up in the morning and you just wash your hair and you do it, it never looks quite as good as it used to do 20 years ago. Yeah, yeah. But the colour seems to be almost the same. Yes. But it's, it's just some something we're missing. And you think it's tone. Yes. You're just yeah, I tone. just feel, you, you know, you lose the tone. And over over time, your hair is constantly changing, like your skin is yeah. as well. So you're losing the fullness and, yeah. and the texture of it naturally yeah. changes. And especially when you start to get grey in the hair, yes. it gets very coarse. Yes. as well yeah and um, so you, yeah it's it's going to change it's changing yeah so what what would you suggest i don't want to go as long as you Alison. yeah i don't want to go completely blonde when when i was you know 25 yes that's what i had <laughs> straight very blonde hair yes. and i loved it but i don't particularly want that look now one thing is i'm much paler now mm -hmm. and the blonde doesn't sit well against my skin mm -hmm. but i do want it to look as if it's a bit blonde, mm -hmm. as, as if the sun's kissed it, yeah. if you see what I mean. Yeah. So yeah. What, what would you suggest I could do? So I would probably say we go in with, with two tonal blondes in there. I'd probably go for more of like a caramelly high lift tint, first of all, as your, your base highlights, and then just do a sprinkling of some very light ones in there, just so it picks it up and makes it pop a little bit more. Okay. Um, I wouldn't put dark around your face because that the contrast with your skin tone mm -hmm. and it could take the colour out even more so mm -hmm. so I think um, if we just naturally highlight it so put them in quite fine so it looks more sun-kissed than, than a sort of a heavy highlight like what I've got through through the ends of my hair yeah. um, but because you're holding so much natural through the back I would only go for the two because it, it, in the overall effect it looks like you're, you've got sort of three or four tones in there in mm -hmm. the end. So. so if I just turn to face the camera a little mm -hmm. bit and you stand behind me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, so can you just explain what you're going to do to the front? You're going to make it a bit lighter or ha so, just in terms of colour? Yes, so with the front I would say let's let's put the, the lighter ones in there. Okay. So, you know, when pull it back yes. and you've got regrowth in there, it's not going to be such a such a bandage of regrowth okay. in there, so we're working well with your natural as well, so it's keeping okay. the maintenance of the colour down, because sometimes if you go in and we say, yes. right, we're going to completely cover that grey, that's great because you'll get rid of your grey, but, when but within three, four weeks, you're going to start seeing that tram line come through. And it, and it looks worse, doesn't yes. it, when it's grey? Yeah. I yeah. mean, I don't mind dark tram lines they've become popular over the last 20 years they are yeah but um, yeah. but grey tram lines don't look cute do they? no no let's be honest and no. then just for the maintenance of it as well so i always say let's go natural and let's blend okay. rather than let's put a load of color in mm -hmm. and then you've, you're then on the treadmill of coming in every every four to six weeks yeah. to have your color touched up yeah which you know some people can but a lot of people realistically you can't do it. So. Yeah, it gets expensive. Yes. Isn't it? Yeah. Or else pensioners. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. So, yes, that's what I would do overall. Just have the to have lighter through here, and just sprinkle the lighter throughout. But have your your caramelly ones as your natural highlights in there.